Hi guys, welcome to Core Artisan Lab. This is video number 43 for learning MMS system in Django with React.js. In this video, we are going to show the related courses according to the current course. This is our course detail page and we are going to show the uh, related courses. Okay. So, uh, in our previous video, we have shown the uh, course uh, chapters. Okay. So, these are the course videos. Actually, the title is wrong. It should be chapter or we can say all chapter of this course okay so first of all we will change the title uh, course in this course we will say in this course okay so it will just a moment we will say in this course okay now we are going to show the uh, related courses so what we will do here I am showing the text. Okay, if you remember when we are when we add the course, then we also add teacher can also add the text. So according to the current text, we can just show the related courses. Okay, so let's create that. Show that. Sorry. So first of all, I will go to the model here, and we will create a new method related. related uh, videos and we will show here self so this will accept the current object of this model and then we will say related related videos equal to course dot objects dot filter and what we will filter text i contains because it's a string so that we are doing self dot text okay and now we will return so we have to make this uh, make this result to the json so how we can do that first of all we need to import from django dot core we will import serializer okay so we are manually serializing this okay so return serializer return serializer dot now we will serialize in format json okay and these are the related videos right so uh, here we are returning this now we will add this related video in our serializer course serializer here we will show okay now let's see the response what is the response so i'll go to the network okay and i'll refresh the page here oh okay so here we have a api course and if we go to the response here you can see that we have a response in the json uh, json format okay so this is uh, this is a little difference different according uh, our uh, django rest framework seri serialized okay this is something different because we are doing manually okay so let's <coughs> now uh, in the course detail page what we will do here we will create another uh, another set of uh, data that is related data okay or we can say related course data right so here we will say copy paste okay set related course data and in the result what we will do here in the result we have related videos okay and we have to we have to parse as json so what we will do json dot parse and we will add the content here right now let's now let's console this content what we will console related course right now let's refresh the page here go to console and here you can see that we have data so by default it will empty and after that we have this 0 1 and uh, on the top level we have uh, primary key and in the fields we have field data okay you can see that now we will show this data in our related course so here we have a course detail page 
so this is just for the information i will do i will copy this index map uh, very uh, map you can see the map alteration or i will paste here and i'll remove the another one okay and uh, this is and let's complete this okay now if i here related course course data and this will be r course so r denotes to related so r course okay so and uh, let's refresh the page here so here you can see that it is showing a uh, two related data now let's change the detail page okay, again it's showing two related courses so we have the here the course related course so this is showing two related courses okay let's add the title here dot field start title right so here you can see that yes we have a two data uh, django full uh, course and django because in this uh, we have python and django and both have python and django if i go here okay so now we need to show the image so how we can show the image and we also have to add the url here so i'll go here and add this kind of syntax so the first thing will be detail oh sorry detail slash dollar and the id and it's a uh, on a first level so what i will do r course dot course dot tk right and similarly we will do this for this link okay and for this image like rest framework provides the image url it's not provides the image url it's just provide the uh, image path okay so it it will provide media slash uh, whatever the folder name and the image name so what we need to do we need to first of all let's uh, change the all text here okay now we need to provide the path so what i will do here i will simply say simply say let's do this okay and i need to provide the url so we have the url but we have a url with the api suffix so what i will do i'll remove this suffix and i'll just say site url here in this case and for this i'll add slash and site url first of all i will print here the site url this is dollar sorry site url and then we have to provide detail no no this is this will not detail and then we have to provide media okay and then slash and then dollar and then we have to provide the featured image right so featured image right now let's check this can you see that so this is the thing it's working here okay so now what we will do we will just add the link here okay so we have added the link already but we uh, i want to i want to redirect this link on the another tab okay so what i will do i'll just added a target blank okay so now i'll click on this and here you can see that we have a new course so we have successfully implemented the related course okay so in the next video we will implement this uh, calculation uh, this this calculation of the uh, video duration and also the total calculation okay so thank you so much for watching this video and uh, i will upload uh, the frequency of the video uh, now soon okay so sorry i am uh, uploading the videos in very delay but i will try to upload soon as soon as possible okay thank you so much for watching this video please like share subscribe this channel and also support me and follow me on github instagram facebook thank you so much